Hey, what's up guys? This is my first look video for the Mi Opta Optical 5 4 to 20 by 50 second focal plane. And I will tell you probably more times than you want to hear during this video, the glass in this thing for the price that it is, is absolutely outstanding. Out what I'm going to do, I've got the magazine loaded up here. I'm going to shoot one fowler. Then I'm going to shoot a five shot group and we'll see how this thing holds up. All right. Let's get started. I just cleaned the gun. I'm going to see where this first one hits. Okay. Now, let me shoot the other five. Well, I'm glad I shot that foul. All right. Now, this thing doesn't have target turrets, but I'm going to treat it like it does. And sit here and twist and turn on this thing. I know one thing. A lot of these scope companies could take a hint from this damn Neopta for something that's not a target turret. Boy, it is clicky as it can be. I mean, it is tactile, and you can damn sure hear it. I know you got to be picking that up on the map, that's all. All right. Let's try this one. All right, then. Now, the glass is spooky, but that don't mean I won't slap it around and talk shit to it. Also, it's six-step illumination. The center dot is the only thing that lights up, and it is really, really easy to pick up, even in the daylight. It's daylight bright. I know that microphone's got to be picking that up. You can hear that shit. If I wasn't looking at the scope, I would swear it had target turrets on it. The way it sounds and the way it clicks. Zero. Back to zero. Third shot. Damn, this damn thing is putting them right in. How about that, yeah, hammerhead looking devil. Now, guys, you'll see on the screen what the reticle looks like on this thing. And it's really, really nice. And you're also going to see links below to optics for us. That's where I got this thing. And you'll see all the information you'll need to get on optics for us and find some of this stuff. Because right now, that has become my go-to place to get scopes. The guy keeps everything in stock. When you call, you actually talk to somebody. And he has got some of the nicest scope lineups of any shop out there right now. All right, let's look at good groove. Don't mess it up. The remix just keeps hanging. Finish him. Bam, 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 bam. And again, I'm going to talk about the glass on this thing because I just got through using this scope. That the glass was, eh, just average. I mean, seriously, just about average for its price range. But the price range on that scope was a lot more than this scope. And the glass could not touch it. All right, last shot. And the outbox is big. This I'm just getting it. Now, guys, a lot of guys think a one-inch scope that you're giving up some type of clarity, that you're giving up resolution. That is bullshit. 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 A scope like this proves that's the case. By the way, this thing was made in the Czech Republic, and like every single myoptoscope that I have ever looked at and ever tested, this thing, glass-wise, 
hit at the very top of its class. I hadn't said it in a while. Certified badass, baby. Certified.